Right, I'm just having to come back on and share with you what I've done because, um, again, I forgot to put the bloody camera on. I am sorry, but it's basically I painted all the rocks using the dark brown, the burnt, uh, burnt umber, I think it is. Let me just check. Yeah, burnt umber in the acrylic. So I painted them as much as I could, but while it was wet, I then sprayed it with water, which meant it dripped down into all the crevices. Because it's like that jagged rock, it's really hard to get into each uh, crevice. And so as long as you tilt your um, board this way, that way and whatever, you can get deep into the crevices. On top of that, I have then sprayed, not all over, but edges and the floor. Because look, it looks like seaweedy stuff down there. Um, so I just sprayed the outer edges basically and the inner edges with this colour wash which is the um, Durandac Pesto because that gives it a nice seaside or sea look and feel to it. So I've done that. Right, I'm just going to move that a minute. And what was the next bit? Let me just see. Yeah, so um, I just need to do these, like paint these up a little bit. But I think I'm just going to use the Adirondack because it looks like mosses. You know like water when it's been around for a while and you get all the algae? Well, that's what it, it looks like. So I'm thrilled with that, to be honest. So I'm, what I'm going to do is just take the lid off for a minute. Pop that on there. Just take a paintbrush um and dip that in and then just paint that up there just drip it in here and there you know because it really does look like it's uh seaweedy even put some on there we're going to put some moss and that along here so I'm just going to turn this around and put a little bit going up the steps as well, you know. Right, up that leg there. Let's turn that around a bit more. I'm going to get into the back here of that leg. Just paint that up like that. It is a great way of uh, getting that beach look. Let me just do that. I'll paint some up there. You just got to make it look old. Like that. Looks like the moss is growing up the shack and everything. I'm just going to paint the back of the shack with it. Well, it just ages it basically. It really does age it. Like that, and maybe a bit up here. Bit of colouring in there, but yeah, I do like that. It's um, better than I thought it was going to be. But now I really do have to let that dry. I think I've got all the crevices and everything. I like what it's uh, looking like. In fact, I love it actually. And that's it. I'm going to leave it like that. Let that all dry. Hopefully it'll dry overnight. You know, we're going to fill the beach in and that. So I'm not fussed about that at all. And looking like a beach scene, isn't it? Like a fisherman's cove. 
That's what I should have called it, Fisherman's Cove. But hey ho, I'm happy with how it is. When it's dry, I've got the moss to put on, which will be in and out of the rocks. We've got some seashells. Um, I've also got some tiny starfish that can go around. Tiny shells. Uh, and that'll be it, you know. But we've got to let that dry. I'm quite happy with it, actually. The other thing I wanted to do was uh, I needed the poles. Where have I put those poles? Oops, a daisy. Get rid of that. I don't need it now. Now, let me find the poles. There's one. There's. Oh, I might need the tall ones, actually. Let's have a look. No, they're too tall. So let's just see if we can use these. Yeah. Because what I want to do when that's dry, I'm going to glue these in, paint them and glue them in. And I'm going to have the little, these, uh, saying boat shack or something like that on it, hanging from it. I shall see. Might get two letters on one because they look a little bit big if they're like that. Although I should have hung them from there, I think. Boat shack, but then the boat's hanging from there. I don't know, I will see. And like I say, we've got these to hang on. I have another one there to make up when it's dry. Yeah. It's looking quite good. I'm just going to bring the camera down a little bit to show you. There. Hope you like that. Thanks for watching. Take care and I'll speak to you all soon. Bye bye for now.